How's it going? I'm Timothy Ward with RigHands.com and in this video we're discussing the position on the O-Rig of Rig Manager. Now the Rig Manager can also be called the Tool Pusher and you can use the two terms interchangeably. And the Rig Manager is basically the highest ranking member of your company at the rig. So while the driller is the boss of the, of the rig crew, the rig manager is his boss. So not only does he have to make sure that everything is running smoothly on the, on the actual rig, he's also in charge of everything else going on at the drilling site. So as you can imagine, this is a very high stress job because there's a lot of things involved in running a rig site. I mean, he's, like I said, not only in charge of the rig, but there's also personnel issues, there's scheduling, uh, there's safety regulations, there's environmental and, and government laws to worry about. Uh, anything that the rig needs, he's responsible for getting it. Anything that's coming in, he's responsible. Anything that's going out, just a lot of different things going on when you're the rig manager. High stress job, but the pay is very lucrative. I mean, the pay is good as a floor hand. So uh, you can imagine if you've been in this industry, been in that industry for all the years it takes to work up a rig manager, you can imagine the kind of jack you're bringing home, uh, you know, every week. Definitely very lucrative but you will earn that money. Another thing you want to know about the rig manager, his schedule is a little different. Whereas most people work a 12 hour shift and then they're off uh, for 12 hours before they come back, the rig manager is different. While he's working his hitch, which could range from anywhere from two weeks to a month, depending on the company, he's at the rig site the whole time and he's working. Like, uh, you know, they'll have like a trailer where he works at, but there's also like a, 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 a house section where he sleeps and, you know, has a little kitchen and all that. But the rig manager, while he's at the rig site, is working the whole time. There's really no set time where he's off and can go to sleep. If something comes up and he needs to come out there, uh, he has to come out there. If something, you know, somebody comes up with a delivery or something, whatever, the rig manager's on call, he has to be there. So it definitely can be very stressful. Um, I remember I used to work, I always worked the night shift when I was on the rigs, and the rig manager didn't come out to the rigs, to the rig floor a lot, which was actually a good thing, because, uh, you know, when the rig manager came out there, you better be on your best behavior, better get it right, because the one I had, he didn't play. He might give you one, but on that second time, he'd say, get off my rig, you're done. I mean, it was just, it was just that easy. Um, but you kind of got to, you kind of have to be that way when you're running a, you know, multi-million dollar rig. But um, it was the evening shift and he was still up and he held a safety meeting with us at the beginning of our shift and you would see him around from time to time. And he had to do the same thing with the other crew when they came in during the day. So I know the guy was always up and about and it was a lot of work. But like I said, the, the, the compensation is, is, is worth it. And if you ever could get to be a, uh, a rig manager, couldn't nobody tell you you didn't make it. You're successful. Um, but anyway, uh, hope this video was helpful. Um, as always, please check out righands.com. Variety of information on there is helpful for anyone uh, who's in the patch at the moment or anyone who's thinking about you know trying to get a job in the rigs. Also, there's a Facebook page. Got a lot of activity going on there. We're getting a lot of likes, a lot of fans, a lot of people posting pictures and you know stories and videos, things like that. So definitely check that out and give us a like on there. And also, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. It's new. Uh, we're putting this series of videos up, but there will also be lots of different videos coming. And as always, too, if you have any questions, uh, hit us up here on YouTube, on the Rig Hands website, or on Facebook, and we'll definitely try to get back with you best we can to answer your questions. Always looking to uh, help people in the oil rig industry. So my name is Timothy Ward. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you later.